an Arthur A1 and this is a Cirque du Soleil Australian inspired and uh, I've always loved Cirque du Soleil and I love their makeup looks so um, I wanted to do another um, Cirque du Soleil look um, they might be more I don't know uh, we'll see in time um, and yeah so this is the look and I hope you like it stay tuned for the tutorial bye The first thing you're going to do is cover your eyebrows. You can use any method you like. I use the wax method and apply wax. Then I'm going to apply an ultra foundation, a very um, cover foundation and I'm applying it with my finger. Then with a matte powder, I'm going to set that and I'm going to apply another coat of that powder. Now I'm going to uh, create the base of my forehead and I'm using face paint not so I don't have to apply eyeshadow directly on my forehead and also because um, the eyeshadow will really pop if I have colored base. So I'm applying different shades of green, dark green on the outside corner, lighter green on the middle and now some white. Um, try to blend them as uh, much as you can so you have a blended uh, base to apply the eyeshadow. The first eyeshadow I'm going to use is by Glamour Delize. This is Olivia Green. This is a matte dark green. As you can see it's very pretty and it goes along very well with the look. I'm going to be using Sedona Lace. This is a very bright green and I'm applying that on the middle. I'm using Fragrant Glamour by Glamour Delize. This is a shimmery green and I'm applying that over the yellow and also to contour my nose. I'm going to apply Apple Martini on the center of the forehead and I'm going to blend this very well with the other greens. Now I'm going to apply a very shimmery, very bright yellow and blend it along the colors. And last but not least, I'm going to apply a very shimmery white on the center of the nose and also on the center of the forehead. With a black aqua color, I'm going to redefine my eyebrows and I'm also going to fill them in. After the eyebrows are done, I'm going to start with the eyes. I'm, I have applied previously a white base. I applied an NYX eyeshadow in milk. And now I'm using several um, eyeshadows that I have used previously on the forehead to start um, doing my eyes. I'm applying first the dark color and then going to go to the lightest color always blending the, the colors in between with this shimmery white I'm highlighting my fake brow bone now I'm going to do the typical shape of the eyes that represent the most Cirque du Soleil it, it, this technique is to amplify your eyes uh, when it's seen from a distance so I applied a white base and then a black gel liner and now I'm blending that gel liner with olive green and I'm also using a Franken Glamour to um, continue with the greens. You can also line your lower waterline with a white eye pencil. In order to create a more Asian uh, looking eye, I'm doing a cut eye look. This will um, expand a little bit my eyes to the outside. With a white cream base, I'm using NYX uh, eyeshadow pencil in white. I have depotted this and I'm highlighting my um, cheekbones also on the outside corners of my lips because I'm going to do a dark lip and um, in order to 
make the lips stand out uh, when you're on stage it's better to um, have the outsides a little bit whitened I'm using uh, Mila Marcy's uh, dark lip uh, pencil and I'm placing a lighter color on the center uh, the Circle of Soleil always use a 3D uh, lip effect so I'm placing that now with a white eye pencil I'm lining the outsides of my lips so they will be seen in um, on the distance and now I'm contouring my face and also placing my blush I am placing a lot of blush and a lot of bronzer because um, this is a fantasy look it's not a wearable as you may have seen now for the final touches I'm placing some Swarovski crystals on the top and also over my nose most of the time I record a video I always do kind of like a little dance and I edit it off but this time I just didn't <laughs> so you can see my craziness and yeah this is the final look I hope you enjoyed it and thank you so much for watching please comment like and subscribe it really means a lot and bye